today is Monday, July 18th. And right now I am at the uh, drive through Subway drive through getting a Subway breakfast sandwich. Um, those things are bussing. Um, uh, hold on one second. They are bussing. And um, yeah, so it's been a crazy morning. Good morning, lady. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing well. Good. Six yep. <laughs> I'll take the honey wheat this time. Yep, ham and cheese. Uh, I take some pepper jack this time. Yeah, I spiced it up this morning. <laughs> All right, and lettuce. Yeah, the whole works. Just a few of the uh, jalapenos, though. Okay, light hot peppers. Everything else. Mm-hmm. And uh, mayonnaise. Uh, light mayo. Uh -huh. And then I'll take it toasted. And then I have the whole eggs. All right, we got a six inch uh, honey oak. You want it toasted with ham, egg white, pepper jack cheese, everything on it, but make the jalapenos light and light mayo. Yep. All right. We have you up in a few minutes now. All right, thank you. Okay, so I need to find someone to sit this at. I'll do that right now. I know when I start driving, it ain't gonna work. But um, yeah, let me remove that it's my uh, car uh, decal for work. So anyway, it was one of those. <laughs> it's one of those mornings. Um, so. You know, um, my son, he had been gone for a week. So, you know, for a week, I was maxing and relaxing, getting up the latest time possible, you know. So, anyway, my son had come back, whatever. And yesterday, I could have sworn I did, like, ample, you know, some preparing. Like, I did my meal prep, uh, well, my lunch prep. Um, I did a facial, well, somewhat of a facial. Um, I did a facial. I tried to um, redo my brows a little bit. I picked out an outfit for me and him, got it ironed up. I polished my toenails with this pretty blue color. I don't know. I have to show it to you later, but this pretty blue color. And why when I'm sleeping, like I feel my toes stuck to each other. So I'm like, are you kidding me? Now I got these baby doll shoes on and I know my um, toenail polish <laughs> is stuck to the top of these shoes. My nose is running. So I get up this morning, you know, hop up in the shower, whatever, whatever, because I've got uh, ample time. So I, uh, yeah, excuse me, I know that's still trifling, but my nose is always running. But, um, you know, everybody had been talking about the Nivea um, Post Balm Shave uh, as a good primer. So there was some on clearance, so I got that. So I tried this this morning. And then as far as my foundation, I feel like a little, I look a little pasty, a little ashy, especially like around this area. And so what happened with that is I usually alternate between two foundations, which is the Revlon Color Stay, and I'm 300 caramel in that one, and then the uh, Maybelline Fit Me. I forgot the number um, of that one, but it's the uh, shade right before the 355 Coconut. It's the shade right before there. And so, um, you know, during the wintertime or whatever, that shade is like perfect for me, but I usually feel like during the summertime when you get a little darker, I feel like it's just a little too light. So, um, I was, you know, alternating for years between those two. So, for the past month or two, I've been wearing the uh, color stain. And that color has always fit me perfectly. And every day I come home, my sister Nimby, oh, why you got that dark foundation on? That foundation too dark. I'm like, bro, this is my color. Like, this is the color I've always gotten. It's always, um, you know fit me I, i'm not understanding you know why y'all keep saying that. oh you that you dark that's too dark so i'm like okay fine so today i decided to go back to the um maybelline fit me in that color and i feel like it's too light i feel like i look a little pasty um i didn't put a whole bunch on but i feel like mm, i don't know I, I don't feel like it's riding with me this morning but oh well, I'm already at the house. Then so I had picked out an outfit and the outfit. 
And so, you know, what I like to do in the morning, I like to go ahead and do all the, um, hold on, she's bringing my sandwich back. Let me get my money to gamble. Um, excuse me. Okay, boy, money flies out of, out of your hands, boy. But, anywho. Four thirteen. Four thirteen. Okay, let's see. Thank you and I don't know you. You too. Okay, so I know my phone is going to fall, but anyway, um, whoop. <laughs> see, um. So, um, so anyway, <clears throat> I picked out outfit, irons it or whatever, and usually how I like to do things in the morning, I like to, you know, go ahead and take a shower, get all of that out the way, you know, um, the last thing I do is put on my clothes, so I like to have my, my, my makeup on, all of that good stuff, sundress and everything, and then, you know, I go put my outfit on, okay, and so this morning, we just happened to be running behind and I put my outfit on and I was like, oh, uh -uh, no, sir, I cannot come through like that. <laughs> it was a pair of pants that I had worn in a while, but, you know, I got booty on top, but the bottom don't be acting right. And I just, I, 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 to me, I don't feel like, I cannot be walking around with... <laughs> I know it's just, I know it's just me, but I cannot be walking around with that scrunchy booty on the bottom and my shirt ain't long enough to cover it. Like, mm -mm, I, to me, I, you know, it ain't about, it ain't about what other people think. Like, I'm past what other people think. It's about how I feel. Like, mm -mm, I got to get back on my squats because to me, that's, mm -mm. So, and then they were kind of a little high water. Then the shirt just wasn't meshed. And I was like, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I usually have to leave the house at 8 o'clock. And that was like 7.50 when <laughs> I did that. So, I was like, oh my gosh. So, you know, I tried a different shirt, a couple of different shirts. And I'm just, I'm just like, you know what? Two through. So, I ended up just throwing on something. Like, ugh. So, I ended up just throwing on something didn't even have time to iron it so my shirt does have a few wrinkles in there and then i haven't done my brows in a long time i usually just have been rocking my natural brow like i'll shape them up and i've been rocking my natural brow and so this morning I, and so this weekend i was like you know what and, and when i tell you that it's been a while it's like been a year since i've actually did like the sculpting of the brow and all of that stuff and i was like you know what makeup is my passion is one of my passions is something that i'm actually good at like why am i like what's up bro but anyway that's a whole nother video so this weekend i uh you know tried to do them <laughs> and i did it with a pencil and oh my gosh <laughs> just harsh and terrible bowl okay so this morning i was like okay you know what let me try it again but this time i'm gonna try it with the brow powder mm. <sighs> they all right i mean they it's not it's not my best work and you know other people be like oh no they fine they look good you know but you yourself you know the work that you're capable of you know the work that you've done and it's just like not satisfactory and this is not satisfactory to me at all so i'm just like oh okay so finally get out the house trying to do 1500 things getting out of the dang on house and uh get to camp and i forgot this weekend i had switched wallets so get there to drop my son off camp i'm hustling and bustling trying to hurry up and get there i'm working up a sweat like oh then i get in there forget that i grabbed the wrong wallet had to go back out there to the car and get the wallet again i'm just like okay boom you need to do a one two a one two three breather i finally get back in the car i'm all flustered and like my my sweaty areas is like right above my brow oh my goodness i get in the car i'm all sweat and i'm just like Ugh. like really like what happened to the plan this morning um I'm gonna be the bag lady. I got my five bags that I'm toting. I'm talking really loud, so excuse me. Um, and then, of course, I stopped at Subway. It's not something that I usually do because, you know, we go, uh, yeah, I gotta check it in the savings. And yeah, so 
I got a breakfast sandwich this morning because I'm extremely hungry. I'm always hungry when I wake up in the morning. Like, I don't care if I ate good, you know, the night before. Like, I always wake up hungry. Like, and it's Monday. I'm already making excuses. I said there was going to be no soda today, but I'm already making excuses because there's a report at work that I have to do every Monday. And this report generally takes about maybe three and a half, four hours for you to do. Um, and this is every Monday that I have to do this report. And I'm not complaining because I know how to do it. Um, well, I'm getting the gist of, I, I can pretty much do it, but sometimes I need to go back and recheck and double, and, you know, and all of that. And it takes three and a half, four hours doing it regular. So they want to have to redo or, you know, go back and stuff like that. It could take longer than that. So sometimes it can be, you know, like, whoo, whoo. So, um, um, I, I, I need something on my stomach. So I got to do better with my meal preps um and prep for breakfast as well um so i need i've been needing something on my stomach to hold me over while i'm doing that report and then because i usually once i started like i really don't like to take a break or anything like that um i just like to go full force and go ahead and, and knock it on out the way so um and you know soda is my addiction but you know what this addiction here gonna die um so anyway i'm just gonna have a soda today yeah um, but yeah, so I'm on the work. <laughs> I'm pulling into work now. It's supposed to be here at 30. It's 826. You already know. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna show you guys the breakfast sandwich that I got. It's from Subway. It is so good. Um, it's so good. And it's a six-inch sub, and I'm mad that the breakfast sub is cheaper than um the regular sub. You're not getting those six inch for no three or four dollars. Like, so the breakfast sub is pretty good and it's definitely fulfilling because I get all the veggies on there. Oh yeah, so I won um, parking spot for the week. It's a valet because, you know, we have to park, you know, sometimes it could be a little distance away. If somebody up at my parking spot today, I'm going to have to regulate. Let me see. Let me see. Oh. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm laughing because... <laughs> Somebody was in my parking spot and they in the move. <laughs> but um but yeah, so you know, despite it all and, and overall, I am feeling fantastic this morning. I am yeah, I'm feeling fantastic this morning. This is a bad angle. Um what you looking at? People just be so dang on nosy though, bruh. And he gonna walk all out in front of me though, huh? But you wanna be nosy. Like, people kill me with that. <laughs> anyway. So, um, I want parking spot of uh, for the week. So, I'm pulling in now. But anyway, like I said, I'm going to... Uh, when I get in to get situated, I am going... <laughs> Because people walking by looking at me talk to myself. But anyway, so when I get in and get situated, I'm going to show you guys um, the breakfast sandwich. Do a little ASMR. I think, that it, I think that's what it is. It's not going to be too much talking, like I said. Because I work in a cubicle. And it's not like it's uh, loud in there. So, alright. I'm running behind, so I'll talk to you guys in a few. Okay, hey guys. I'm back. So, I made it into the office. Still not settled. I am just like, eh, in rare form, all over the place. But I'm gonna get it together. Um, I am kind of whispering because I do work um, in a cubicle, so it's not like I have a door, and it's not that loud um, in here, so everyone can hear what I'm saying. Um, like I'm like, who did you talk to? But anyway, um, <laughs> I forgot I had a meeting because I was gonna wait. Um, I was gonna wait, you know, a little later to um, dive into the sandwich, but I forgot I had a meeting. That meeting was like an hour and a half long at 10 30, and I just can't wait that long. Anyway, I'm still trying to get used to looking at the camera and not myself. Um, so, anyway, I'm just gonna be doing some more. I'm gonna pull out the sandwich in a minute because, you know, I'm lunching. And like I said, I'm just all over the place. I have. <laughs> but it's funny though. Um, just. Yeah, but I feel great today. And, you know, Pepsi Plus. This is the only soda that I'm drinking today. Like, I just got to do better. And Brock. Ooh. I'm going to have to cut that clip out, okay? My 
I'm Nicholas. Extreme Retreat and Bay. I have my gallon of water that I will be attempting to drink today. Okay, so. I'm gonna eat the, um, the whole sandwich. I'm just gonna take a couple of bites and show you guys. That's why walking up the stairs with all the bags I have. <clears throat> I had a purse, a gallon of water, my big lunch bag I just showed you, and then a work bag. And I was walking up the steps because I'm going to try to, well, since I've been here, I've been making a daily habit to um, walk up the stairs instead of take the elevator. So I bust a sweat. Cause usually I'm cold, but I bust the sweat, so I had to cool off. But yeah.
even burn water down. I'm not about to invite you like that. Ooh. I know y'all like punk and shit jalapeno, but I'm just not about that spicy like that. Oh, well, I got the burn for me to taste it. All right.